Hi, this is John. Welcome to another video. Today I'm in Lightroom Classic in the library grid and we're talking about dragging and dropping images into a collection or a published service which are effectively collections. So I'm already in my folder called Altavir 1 and I've set up a collection called Dolomites and I want to add some photos to it. So I'm going to select um, six photos randomly. The first one's already selected, so I'm just going to control click on these. That's three, four, five, six. That will do for the basis of this demonstration. Now it's important to drag from the center of a thumbnail. Avoid um, clicking around the borders of the photo or uh, avoid the badges stay away from that area completely. So click in the center and then drag. Now you can see these black lines appearing. If you accidentally release the mouse that will actually <laughs> rearrange the folder completely as you can see. The order here at the bottom, the sort order, has now changed to custom order. And that can happen quite easily by accident so I wanted to just make you aware of that. So I'm going to change the sort order back to capture time and let's start to move to a collection. This folder panel of mine is actually quite long, so there's quite a distance down to the collections. I'm going to collapse it. Um, the photos will still remain selected from that folder, and I can just have the um, collections panel open now. And I'm hovering over this um, collection called Dolomites, which already contains four photos. So that, the, this additional six will bring it up to ten. I always think starting on the left hand side there's less distance to travel when dragging and we simply drag all those six selected photos to Dolomites. You can see the photos get highlighted. Now if you're not correctly in, in the correct place you can see this circle with a line through it. So you need to actually make sure that those thumbnails are visible and then release the mouse. And as you can see that's now increased to 10 photos and clicking on the collection shows those six new photos that we've added to it. I hope you find this um, helpful and um, um, one other thing you can do to make it absolutely foolproof is to right click on your collection before starting and choose from the context menu set as target collection and you can see the plus symbol there which is normally on the quick collection is now made that into a target collection. So if we go back to the folders now and um, select another bunch of um, photos, let's just select all of these by shift click. And all I have to do now is press the B key on the keyboard and it confirms that those have been added to the target collection. So let's go back to the collections um, panel. And there we can see that our target collection now has 22 photos. And it was simple to do that straight from the folder, having set it up as a target collection. Don't forget when you finish to go back to your quick collection, right click and make that the target collection again. I hope this is all useful and um, thanks for watching. Goodbye. Mm -hmm.